In 1860, Herman Hollerith was born to German immigrants in Buffalo, New York on February 29th. In 1879, Hollerith graduated from the Columbia School of Mines having taken courses in chemistry, physics, geometry, surveying, and graphics. In 1882, he joined the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, otherwise known as MIT, where he taught mechanical engineering and conducted experiments with punch cards that later led him into creating the tabulator. In 1884, he left MIT as he disliked teaching now and instead began working for the United States Census Office. In 1890, Hollerith married Beverly Talcott on September 15th. The 1890 census used the tabulating machine that Herman Hollerith created. The data sets for the census were completed within only one year, unlike the 1880 census that took eight complete years. In 1896, he founded his first business, the Tabulating Machine Company. Census and insurance offices around the world purchased his equipment to use for statistical data purposes. In the 1900 census, censuses around the world used Holler as tabulators. In 1906, he introduced a control panel to his tabulator that helped his tabulator perform different jobs at once more easily and efficiently. In the year 1911, Holler's business, as well as three other corporations, merged to form the Computing Tabulating Recording Corporation, otherwise known as CTR. In 1924, CTR was renamed as International Business Machine Corporation, otherwise known as IBM, making Hollerith one of the main founders of IBM as the business that we know today. Lastly, in 1929, Herman Hollerith died in Washington, D.C. on November 17th of a heart attack. Today, there's a commemorative plaque installed by IBM in Georgetown, Washington, D.C.